Hi everyone! Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Nicole. I have another island tour for you guys today. As you can see, today we're on the island of Milky Way. So this island is actually by one of my partners on Instagram. We toured one of her islands a few videos ago. She had like a farm core type island. And today we're going to be touring her kid core island. And as you know, I love kid core. So I'm really excited to check out this island from what I've seen of like pictures and everything. It looks really amazing. So let's just get right into it. Of course, we're going to take a look at the map first. So we have Joanna. And for villagers, there's Hamlet, Peanut, Molly, Derwin, Freckles, Megan, my boy Stitches, Dom, PHRO, and Shino. That's a lot of cuties. I really like her choice of villagers. And look at this map. Look at all that pathing. Path I'm excited. So let's just go. Okay, look at this entrance. I really love the vibe of this already. And there's so many different ways to go. I guess I'm just gonna head to the right first. And like we have this little like waiting area for the airport. I love this. I like how she used the magazine stand. I feel like I don't see that one a lot. And I love the radio on top of the, uh, what is that called? Hello, wake up Nicole. The drink machine, it looks really cute up there. I like that. And I like this random stroller on the street too. And a little playground right here. This honestly is kind of tripping me out because we use a lot of the same custom design codes so it's kind of funny it's like seeing my island in an alternate universe i really like this like grass path here that she uses though i do it's really cute Ooh, and look at this school bus i like that she put a roof on it that looks really cool and i like how it's just driving down the street too that's cute i also love all of these random little custom designs on the ground like i really like this bee super kid core and cute I like the view here too, that's pretty. And I really love using these trash bags. I just recently started like using those on my island and I really like how those look for kid core. For some reason they just fit so perfectly. And oh, look at this. Oh my gosh, that's huge. I'm guessing this is a school. That is a huge, oh my gosh. That is really cool. And of course a little basketball court over here. I like the color she used. The green and the orange look really nice together. Oh yes, definitely a school. So let's go check it out. Oh my gosh, look at it. We have our little classroom right here. I love how all of the desks are kind of like mix and match with what's on top of them and the chairs and everything. That looks really cool. And I'm obsessed with this blackboard item. It looks so realistic. I love it. And oh my gosh, this TV. This brings back memories of like when your teacher would wheel in the TV and you know you were watching a movie that day. That was like the best day ever. And we have a little play area back here. This is really cute. I like that. I like the puzzle code on the ground. It kind of reminds me of a play mat. I like that. And of course the mix match lockers. I feel like that is like a staple when you make a school on your island. I love that. Oh, and cute. We have a little cafeteria back here. I like the combination of these chairs and table. I don't see those a lot, I feel like. And they're super kid core. Oh, and look at this tiny little garden over here. Whenever I think something's cute, I have to call it little, but really, this is adorable. I love it. And look at, there's a duck pond back there. That's adorable. I love that view. That's really pretty. Such a nice space filler, too. Really just adds a lot to her island. It looks great. And of course, a soccer field. I love this, too. Again, that B code right here is super cute. I love it. Which way do we go? Let's check out this gyroid store because we are right here. Look, we have Lloyd's gyroids. This is so cute. I absolutely love this code. I've seen it a few times and every time I see it, I think it's the best thing ever. I like that she uses a storefront here with the actual gyroids in there. I think that looks really cute. Uh, let's go back here. I don't want to miss anything and I get distracted very easily. <laughs> okay, so we have a little dog park right here. Oh, I love how they're all like actively running and barking. <laughs> That's really cute. Look at Hamlet. He's such a cutie. He's out taking a stroll. Ooh, look at this. Oh my gosh. What a beautiful view. 
Wow, so she has a big carnival back there. I'm excited to go see that. Oh, I like the waterfall in front of this bridge too. That's really pretty. Oh, we're here. Oh, I like that circus sign. That is so cute. Ooh, let's go see. Wow, look at this. That is amazing. Look at how giant this carnival is. I love the vibes of this carnival. I've been trying to build a carnival on my island for some time now, and I just feel like I can't get it right, but everything is so perfect here. I absolutely love it. I hope this little wheel back here with the present next to it. Oh, and look at this arcade area. That's so perfect. And of course, the Ferris wheel. Gotta have the Ferris wheel. All of the patterns on the ground are so perfect. I also love how she dropped these little candy pieces everywhere. Oh, and we have a nice little seating area over here. Look at all the fast food on the table with the food truck. I love that. <laughs> oh, and I like the boat here too. That's just so perfect. I really love these little peninsulas like this. They're so cute and they always come out so nicely whenever people decorate them. Oh, look at this fun house coat over here. This is so cool. I like how she has like the giant circus tent and then she has the little fun house over there. That's really cool. Okay, back over above the carnival. I like this land bridge a lot. I like these, um, I don't even know what these are. <laughs> I don't remember the name of them, but I like the using those as a fence for a bridge. It looks really cool. Oh, we're at the campsite now. I love all of the tents and the sleeping bags everywhere. It's so cozy. There's so many pretty colors too. I'm in love. I really like this little chairs over here with the cookies on the table. Oh, and the little laundry area right here. Just a cute area overall. I love it. Ooh, what's going on over here? <laughs> Looks like we got a robot versus Godzilla fight. Oh no, there's houses on fire. <laughs> I love that. That is such a nice detail. That actually looks like the houses are burning. Wow, that's awesome. I also like the rocket in the back. Is that where the robot came from? Did the robot come from space? Asking all the important questions here. Ooh, this is cute. We have a birthday party. I love this bubble maker. How cute. Also, all the different color froggy chairs look super cute here. I must say, this island is super colorful. It's very pretty to look at. Like, just anywhere is so picturesque because there's so many colors. Oh, we have a little bathroom back here. I love those on a kid core island, honestly. They're so pretty. Ooh, wait, look at this. We have a movie area. This is so cute. I love all the different cushions she used on the ground. I really love all the mismatching. <laughs> This projector screen item is such a game changer. I love seeing everyone's different like ways of using it and making different movie areas. Always so pretty. Wow. I seriously cannot get over all the colors here. They're just so gorgeous. Oh, we have a nice little unpacking area for nooks. I like the teddy bear on that truck. That's really cute too. Oh, and on the other side, there's a yard sale. This is clever. That's smart to do next to your nooks. I also like the combination of items she used here. It definitely feels like a yard sale. <laughs> like this chainsaw. Never even realized that item before. <laughs> Oops. Let's go. What's over here? Oh, okay. A gas station. <laughs> I like this too. I love all the different colors here. I feel like for all of her builds, she just tries to use as many colors as possible, and it looks so good every time. Oh, it looks like we're getting to the villagers' neighborhood over here. I like this. They all have their own little individual yards, it seems like. Oh, they're all so cute. I like this one. It seems like they have their own little reading area. I also really like the teddy bear on the box. Oh, and that connects back to over here. I didn't notice that before that we could walk through here. I also like how she used the jail bars here as a fence. It makes that area feel just like totally isolated. And I also love these vertical board fences with the mismatching colors. I think they look so nice. Oh, look at this person's house. They have a little flower shop. That is adorable. 
I really love the way that she layered these neighborhoods. Like there's all kinds of items behind the houses, behind the fences. Makes it feel really lively. I love it. And I love putting these storefronts together to make a house. I actually saw that on her first island and I thought it was really smart. I hadn't seen that before. So I ended up using that on my island and I think it looks really cute. It just looks like random little houses and I love that. Oh look at I think this is Derwin's house. Am I right about that? That's shocking. I don't really know anybody's house, but I guess I got that right. But we have a little bug area for him. I really like that. That seems really fitting. Like, he would be a bug hunter. Oh, look at the little gnomes down here, too. This is so cute. I can't get over it. Wow, look at all of these mismatched fences. Oh, and I love these boxes here next to the trash cans. Oh, look at the yard sale ads too. That's cute. It's like somebody was passing them out and they dropped them. Oh, and we have another duck pond over here. I am a sucker for duck ponds. Oh, how cute. I really like the uh, mismatched fences here too. I like how she has that a lot around her island. Ooh, what do we have over here? Okay, our Abel sisters. I like this. So we have like a huge continuation of the store outside. And I love how she placed items on top of the shelves. That looks awesome. It makes that area just feel so full. I really like this newspaper code right here too. That's really cute. Oh my gosh, look at this with the watch. And the makeup pouch. This is so interesting. There's so many details. I also love the little shopping carts right here. We have another storefront. What do we have here? It's like a little ice cream place. This is awesome. I really like the um, the storefronts again. I like how she layered them. They look really nice. Okay, and that just connects us back to the dog. And then back on the other side of Abel's, we have a laundry mat. I really like this. The code on the ground here is really cool. I love that. That's definitely perfect for a laundry mat. It matches that laundry sign with the duck so well. It's really cute. Oh, I like the fruit items here too. I like the TV with the couch. I feel like that's so like cozy. You can just watch TV while you're doing your laundry. Oh, look at these socks on the floor. They match the floor so perfectly. I know I already said it like five times, but I love how mix and match all the colors are. It's just so pretty. Okay, let's go down. And we're back at Residence Services. I know that she did have a mini build behind there. Yeah, so she has this like little construction area. I think this is so cute too. I love this. I feel like this is such a perfect thing to put behind your Residence Services. Let's actually head down from resident services because we didn't check out the right side of her island. So let's go do that now. What do we have here? Oh, that's so cool. We have Baskin Robbins. I love these soft serve lamps with the rainbow too. They're so cute. Oh, and there's a whole seating area over here. I love this. The pink and cream like colors together. They look so nice. Oh, how pretty. Oh my gosh. I love that little ice cream sign over there too. That is adorable. One thing that I do want to point out that I noticed on her island a few times is she uses these like curtains in front of these um, retro transportation stops and I really like how that looks. I think it looks really nice. Okay, and we have another store here. Oh, we have a surf shop. That makes sense. I love how she uses little hula dancers here the beach chairs. I also love these beach towels and the chip coat in between them. How cute. Oh my gosh, look at this. Oh wow, this is incredible. So she has Blathers tent. I honestly love how she has the tent. I really wish that I still had the tent, but I have my OG island, so I have the full museum really wish you could just like make the tent 
instead of the building because I think it's so much cuter, especially on Kid Core. But I love how she designed this. It's like a little research area outside of here. We have the gyroid fragment. That's so perfect. I like how the oarfish is in this huge pool. This looks really cool. Wow. I'm loving just absolutely how many items she's used in this island. It's so full and there's so much to look at. You could almost miss it if you blink. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. We have Joe's Crab Shack. Look at that sign. The little crab on it is adorable. <laughs> Stitches toy store, of course. I feel like Stitches has to have a toy store. Oh, I love her layering here. Look at the shelves in the back with the TV on top. This is so perfect. Wow. Oh, and look, we have another beach area just decorated over here. I love all the chairs. Oh, this reminds me of like camping. This is so cute. I like the fish on here. It like is a perfect fit. That's adorable. Okay, I think we've seen everything on Milky Way. What an adorable island. Oh my god. Kid Court is probably one of my favorite aesthetics, so I always have such a fun time exploring different Kid Court islands and seeing how other people do these kinds of islands, because I feel like there's so much you can do with them, and it's always so fun to see how other people have a take on Kid Court. I really enjoyed the like overgrown town vibe that Milky Way had, and like I said like 20,000 times throughout the video, I really loved how colorful everything was. It's It was just so perfect. There are so many details on this island, so much to look at. I really hope I didn't miss anything because everything was just so gorgeous. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like and subscribe. It really helps me out. Also, don't forget to go check her out on Instagram. I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!